whatever its credentials as a sports car, and they seem to be impressive, the Spyker C8 aileron is an attention-getting device of pretty intense wattage. It even draws stares from the pilots of Ferraris, Lambos, and other exotics. We know this from an early morning blast down California's spectacular Highway 1, south of Carmel, where the Spyker loped confidently at naughty speeds in straight places, and Lamborghini drivers, engaged in the same kind of dawn frolic, acknowledged the C8 with headlight flashes and the occasional wave. This is a good omen for Spyker because its buyers generally own a Lambo or a Ferrari already, plus three or four other cars. But wherefore art thou aileron? Spiker literature uses numerous aeronautical allusions, including a propeller logo, citing an aviation heritage. This seems to be a reach. It's true that the original Dutch company was involved in aeronautical endeavors as well as automobile production, but Spiker Automobile Fabrik shut down in 1925. The current company was established in 2000. Still, the aileron's various air intakes do give the car a look reminiscent of early jet warbirds and all the vents are functional, the scoop jutting from the roof feeds the 4.2-liter Rowdy V8 grumbling away just behind the cabin, all muscled up with 400 horsepower and 354 pound-feet of torque. Made it to an optional, $10,000, six-speed ZF automatic, that's enough to thrust this 3,150-pound, aluminum-intensive, wheels, control arms, space frame, bodywork mid-engine coupe to 60 miles per hour in 4.2 seconds, if the manufacturer's claims are correct.